Hello, this is RV Vagabond Jerry, and today I'm in Tatum, New Mexico, which is about 100 miles southwest of Lubbock, Texas, and just about 15 miles into the New Mexico border. And Tatum has a population of only about 900. It's about a 4,000 foot elevation. And I'm here at Lady Hall Trailer Park, is what the sign says behind me. However, if you look it up on Google Map, it calls it Tatum NM Free Camping. Then there's this other sign that says Randolph Rampy RV Park, so it's got three names. And as you can see, it says three night stay limit. By the way, they do have fairly good internet here. There are some barbecue pits, but only one picnic table to be shared by everybody here. Then there's a big open field here where you can play games if you want. There are five hookup spaces. Each box has 20, 30, 50, and their water hookups is down inside of here. This one has a different type of water cover. Now for this one, the water connection has just sunk down into the ground. So if you need water, check out the various bases to pick one that's going to work for you. And one really, the goofiest thing about this place is the placement of the dump stations. So this is one of the sites and the dump station is right in the middle of the site. <laughs> right there about six feet or eight feet from the street there. And that is where they put all of their dump stations. Right in the middle of the campsite. So be careful pulling in so that you don't drive over it. There's a dumpster and the parking area is paved but there is some loose gravel in it. Well there's another picnic table. Now this building right here is the Tatum Community Center. However, there is no sign saying when they're open or what is inside the building. Right across the street is the city park, so I'll show you a little bit of that. There is a baseball field, and it looks like they are trying hard to get the grass to start growing for the summer. There's a restroom building here, and a big pavilion, a couple smaller pavilions over there, and a children's playground, and a lot of room to play games. This looks like a wishing well, but it's padlocked, so no wishes today. Now, under this big pavilion is a couple basketball nets there on both sides but that is about it for the park you can go swinging here <laughs> yep not much else here this is downtown Tatum and I am going to have lunch at the steakhouse Cafe. Hope the inside looks better than that sign. <laughs> They've got a really good menu here and I ordered a ham steak <laughs> with three big pieces and it comes with a self-service salad bar. There's one interesting thing I wanted to show you in Tatum and it is an art store that is called Poor Boys Metal 
art. We got some really tall cactuses, cacti <laughs> here, and I guess you might call this a monkey tree. See the monkey hanging on there? And some kind of uh, maybe an eagle on top. And another one here. There's your eagle. And there's your monkey. Looks like they've also had some alien visitors here. And one ship that didn't want to come too close to the ground. Here's some more monkeys and all sorts of animals around here. It's like a zoo. Got some bears and giraffe, some deer, and back here are some more alien visitors. How about that folks? Nice. He also builds fences with sections in them like this. And here's another one. There's another one. And we got real cactus and metal cactus. Really nice work here. And this is what he has out front at the street. And he's got a Texas flag, P-O-W-M-I-A, U.S. flag, and New Mexico flag. Right in the main street through town. Definitely stop by here if you go through Tatum. Good day, folks.